The suspect is the third passenger to have been arrested this month at Newark Airport for carrying a gun in accessible property. At least three people were killed and 11 others injured Friday after a gunman opened fire at two schools in the Brazilian state of Acerido Santo, according to local authorities. The 2022 FIFA World Cup continued Friday as England and the United States battled to a scoreless draw. Here are the top plays. Given the scale of destruction from Russia's invasion, his words are certain to infuriate Ukrainians. Black Friday is here, and it has brought low-hanging fruit in the form of great discounts on a variety of Apple devices. The gunman didn't have a criminal history, officials said.